Hello everyone, Damon and Sophie here for the Bring a Trailer No Reserve 1982 Mercedes 280 SL. Get this, five speed manual. Get this, less than 10,000 miles on it. Uh, we're gonna do a quick cold start, a walk around, and Sophie's gonna take this on a test drive. Probably take the top down. And uh, what else? Maybe take it downtown to her favorite town. Uh, if we come over here, you'll be able to see the exhaust. I'll put my hand down here. On the exhaust, oh yes. It's so hot, it's burning my hand right now. <laughs> I'm kidding, it's uh, 84 degrees. Alrighty, so let's see, let's talk about this. This set came out of a private collection. Um, We've had the car for about four or five months. We did have the valve cover removed so we could see inside to verify the miles. Uh, there's a lot of you on Bring a Trailer that are making comments about the chrome eyelids or fender chrome, uh, whatever you want to call them, chrome lids or stainless lids. And I'm going to talk about, I did remove one from the other side so you'll be able to see that. But you want to get in and yep. fire it up? It's been sitting here for a couple days. Uh, we have another Mercedes back there that's going on Bring a Trailer. Some Corvettes. Another Corvette here. A lot of uh, unique, no reserve cars coming up on Bring a Trailer. So, uh, VIN number here. Car's in really amazing condition. Um, as, as a lot of you know, there's a lot of wear points. And this one's special because it's a Euro. Obviously, the bumpers um, show that. And I'm going to show you this. Here, we took the eyelid off that side, but uh, okay, let's fire it up. No smoke whatsoever. Doesn't use any oil, doesn't smoke. Listen to the motor. I don't know what these sounded like back in 1982, but there is not one little rattle, lifter noise, nothing. Listen. It is so quiet. Mercedes radiator. Uh, the car is all factory. There are a couple blemishes and I'm going to go through those. Sophie's going to move it out here. She looks good in that convertible. Good color combination. So a couple things. I'm going to feature some of the good and the bad. The first off is to look at these lights. There's no hazing, no cracking. Um, you can tell the car has always been stored in a climate con controlled environment. The rubber on this is, is still soft. Uh, we did remove this eyelid because some of you wanted to see, is there any rust? There's discoloration underneath the eyelid. This is probably where the black was touching because there is a black piece, as you can see here. And that just discolored the paint. So that could be wet sanded and polished out if somebody didn't want those. But there is zero rust underneath. Uh, there is no rust on this car whatsoever anywhere. It's in absolutely phenomenal condition. And you can just tell that it's not been stored outside. All of these pieces are soft. There are a couple blemishes on the front. There's a chip here that's been repaired. Uh, somebody touched that up with silver paint. There's a couple on here. There's one here. The little nick along here. There's a little discoloration right here. I don't know what this is. It's almost like the clear um, had an issue. Windshield is in perfect condition, as far as I can see. There's a little uh, the rock hit here, 
but there's no crack. Top's in amazing condition. There is the hard top. There is a spot here on the front bumper. There is a nick on the front bumper and there's a nick in the black rubber on this side. So for somebody that's OCD like me, that is definitely noticeable and that's there. So want to make sure that was highlighted. The car is really in phenomenal condition. No dings, no scratches. There are a couple of blemishes up here on the top uh, where the hard top was sitting on this side, on the driver's side. There's a couple blemishes here, here. There's four, looks like four of them and it's from the hard top. And we checked and made sure that the rubber seal is, is good uh, so it doesn't cause any more damage, but there is a little blemish there. That's about it. There's a little scratch right here on the driver's side and Nick here. But if you look down the side of the car, the paint, it's, it's really, in like, like new condition. Well, new for what it is. Lower balance is in great condition. Top. Tiny bit of discoloration in the the rear window. Very little. I would assume this is a factory. Looks like the factory top. Radio. Everything works on it. So yeah. Ready to do your thing? Yes, ready. Excited? It is a manual. Are you going to drive shoes or barefoot? Uh, I'll start with shoes. Okay, give it a shot. This is pretty normal for these. If they've been uh, in the heat or in excessive uh, bad humidity or what have you, you'll have issues down here. But this up here is very normal it's for all of them. How many miles? 10,178. Everything works inside. does have an aftermarket radio, has the top cover, the hard top cover, all the tools, spare tire, everything's in immaculate condition. So there you have it. Other than it needs to be vacuumed out a little bit. Okay, we'll send her on her way. drive so nice. One eyelid and one non-eyelid in the back. Sophie in that manual five speed, five speed 280 SL. Wow, what a neat car! The Euro model, 10,000 original miles. We are going to replace, there's a rubber grommet that goes on the rear muffler. We're going to have that replaced before the buyer. It is running at no reserve, so somebody is going to take this one home. What do you think? Nice. You like it? It's really nicely, yes. Yeah. yeah. Sounds good, looks good. Very you look smooth. You look good in there. I do. Yeah. yeah I like the You're going to look better when the top's down. Oh, yeah. 
Okay. Now that it's warmed up, let's hear hear a purr. Whoa. Oh, 2.8 liter. Wow. Alrighty. This is a no reserve Mercedes 10,000 mile 280 SL. And where can you buy it at? Bring a trailer. Where? Bring a trailer. You gotta be excited. Bring a trailer. <laughs> <laughs> we love bring a trailer. <laughs> oh, she's so excited. All right, everybody, we'll see you soon. And uh, hopefully you get a chance to watch the test drive. Bye, everybody.